Off the corner of Northwest 17th and Thurman sits this vacant building. Just outside are signs of Portland's struggles with addiction and mental illness. Feels like we're just like not cared about. Like we're just like insects or something. There's been a huge uptick in mental health issues and crises that are related to fentanyl. Vanessa Sturgeon of Sturgeon Development Partners bought the building in 2018. It had a price tag of $6.8 million. This building is 67,000 square feet. She put another $18 million into renovating it with the intention of renting it out as office space. But she had no luck finding tenants. An old display of the office renderings sit by the front doors. And we delivered it to a market that didn't need more office space. So she's turning it into something Portland does need. This entire area will be residential. As Willamette Week first reported, the building will have a mental health crisis center paired with 80 transitional housing units. Obviously, it's not what we expected from this market, but at the same time, our goal is to, to be the first project like this and we're hoping that other developers will follow suit. She's partnering with the California-based group Jackson House. They offer residential and mental health services. It's a unique opportunity to move somebody from the street into permanent supported housing, um, the entire continuum under one roof. To help people like Sky, he's addicted to fentanyl and camps a block away. Um, what a blessing, I feel like it would, it would be good for the homeless people and the people in need of addiction services. So this whole project sounds great, right? Well, it all depends on one thing, financial support from local governments. She's asking for $22 million to complete the construction. We've been in planning for several months here, but we just started meeting with government officials over the last 90 days. Portland City Commissioner Carmen Rubio's office tells KGW that this is precisely the kind of idea they're looking for and are already looking for funding sources. Mayor Wheeler's office declined to comment and said they're waiting to learn more about the project. If Sturgeon gets what she needs... We're ready to go. She hopes to have it finished in about 15 months. It's an opportunity I think that is uh, rare um, and I'd sure hate to see it slip by. In Northwest Portland, Blair Best, KGW News.